Salutations everyone, my name is James Tisana Teramon and today our group will be demonstrating on how to cook a murtabak maggi. How exciting! It is such a norm for students to hoard a mountain of maggi. But as time goes by, we crave innovation in our mundane life because variety is the spice of life. This is why we want to demonstrate to you how students can improvise and innovate maggi in a most creative and innovative way. Simultaneously, our student life will be more enjoyable and productive and overall fun. Now, moving on to the materials needed for the meal. Hello guys. So, the first thing that we need to cook a murtabak maggi is a wok. Obviously, no wok how to cook, am I right? So, the next thing that we need to cook a murtabak maggi is a large mixing bowl, fork and spoon, a bowl, a plate, and the pan lid. But what about the ingredients? Farid, where's the ingredient? It's right here. Hello, I am Farid, and these are the ingredients needed to make yummy murtabak maggi. We are gonna need a packet of maggi, a curry maggi. I'm using Chintan brand, 100 gram of minced chicken, red chili, carrot, onion, coriander leaves, and a cheddar cheese. Now let's cook this bad boy. Jamel! Okay, first of all, you need to prepare a pot, and then you need to fill some water into the pot. Then you need to heat the water until it until the water is boiling. Put the noodle into the pot. And while waiting, you may start cleaning the tools needed. You can wipe the dishes that will be used to serve the food. Looks like 2 minutes have passed. Next, you have to lift and toast the noodles. Put it in the bowl for a while because we want to set up for the minced chicken. Then, set up the wok. Pour the cooking oil into a wok. And also add 100 gram of minced chicken into a wok. Phew, all this cooking make me exhausted. Shafiq, take the over. Let's get the cow. And then, we wait for the meat chicken until it becomes golden brown. In this case, it has well been cooked. And then, after it becomes brown, golden brown, we put it in small bowl. Then, using the same frying pan, we add some chopped onion. Wait until it smells nice. And then, add some chili, red chili. Wait until it cooks well. And then, uh, now we travel to Sabah for Nazrin to continue the cooking. Hello guys, hello everyone. Hope you're sanitized. Open your ramen from the apple. Next, prepare a large mixing bowl. And then, add two large eggs. One and two. And then, add the maggi seasoning into the bowl. Don't add it too much, okay? That's it. Beat the mixture until it will mix. Beat the mixture until it will mix. Oh. And add all the fried ingredients. The fried minced chicken. Some fine chopped carrot. the coriander leaves and lastly the boiled instant noodle and then mix it together let's do this Ingredient all together until it will mix 
by using the spoon. Farid, it's your turn to do this. So, this is the mixture. So, first, we need to pour some cooking oil into the wok. Put the mixture inside the wok. Slow fire. Make sure to spread the mixture evenly. Flatten the mixture in the frying pan to make sure it has cooked evenly. When the bottom of the mixture has turned into golden yellow, flip the mixture to make sure the top is cooked as well. Now, let the bottom of this mixture become golden brown. Jimmy! Now, while we're at it, we can add some cheddar or mozzarella cheese to make it even more yummy. And then we close it with the pan lid until the cheese melted. Let's try to touch the pan. Oh, what the f Finally! Lift it and put it on the plate. And we're done. Enjoy, you starving and whiny students. Wah, oh, I am sting, yahoo! Ooh. That's the way how to cook yummy murtabak maggi. It is simple and easy but very appetizing. This murtabak maggi only needs 7 material, 10 ingredients and 14 easy steps. All walks of life are able to cook it. Even your student can cook this meal because it is very yummy and mud watering. Have a try! Salutations everyone! So this is the reflection part of the video. I must say that it's been fun doing this assignment. Recording the video, learning new stuff through cooking, editing the video, try to balance uh, my my time between different assignments because this isn't the only assignments that I have to endure <laughs> I have to endure these mountains of assignments you know so kind of kind of balancing uh, my time uh, and kind of like dividing my time towards all these assignments it's it's challenging I barely cook but today I try my best I think I think I did well based on the video and also based on your judgment <laughs> I I always see assignments not just as assignments but as a as an achievement that I have to grab because if I treat my assignment just as an assignment I would not be doing assignments that well and due to the current world situation it's kind of um an idea idea for us life for me because I, I always I always like uh, online class but it always seems to gravitate more towards face to face because it's it's easy to if you want to organize a meeting especially in a group assignments it's easy so in a nutshell I feel it's it's fun it's challenging I like this assignment I like doing it even though there's a lot of hurdles in my life but I overcome it I also got to improve my speaking skills which this assignments gravitates towards to speaking skills and i hope that i get to do this kind of assignment again in in the future especially in my next uh, semester in the university so i guess that's all from me now thank you for your time hi assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh 
I'm Muhammad Jamil Husni bin Abdul Hanif from EP3 Group AV. So here is a video of me, a reflective video BIU2032. The first thing that I love to share in this video is about my experience of making a demonstrative video of cook a yummy murtabak Maggi. During the process of making the video, I'm facing a few constraints that are a bit annoying to me. For example, there is a noise disturbance around my house and I have to do proper time management because there are super many assignments that need to be done in a few days. So in order to solve this problem, I made the timetable and do the records for BIU2032 videos in the early morning because the probability of people and my surrounding making noise in the morning are very low. The point is, challenges are what make life interesting. The way you overcome them is what makes life meaningful. So for those who are watching this footage, I like to say that all is well. Everything's gonna be okay. Okay, so that's all from me. Thank you. Bye-bye. Hello, my name is Muhammad Farid Zuhairi bin Asraf Ali from Group AV. Today, I will explain what I got from making the demonstrative video. To make it clear, we chose the idea how to cook and our video explains how to prepare a yummy murtabak Maggi. First of all, cooking helps in boosting my self-esteem. I learned how to plan and prepare the food from the beginning until the final process. It also is a fun way to relieve stress after a hard day of classes. Next, I gained a new skill, which is cooking. Indirectly, I was able to find out the places that my mom used to keep the cooking items in the kitchen. Besides, I learned a new recipe. Maggi instant noodles not only can be cooked in soup or fried form, we also can innovate it into murtaba, chuchur, or various interesting dishes. Everyone can make it. Be creative. Last, lastly, I was able to develop a new context. Even though we had never met face to face, we still managed to make this video a success. And I am pretty sure that everyone has done their best in their own parts. That's all from me. Thank you. Uh, for my entire life, I would never ever cook murtabak Maggi before. Uh, it turned out to become a very delicious dish which is I can prepare for my family or when someone comes to my house. Even though because of some technically problems such as uh, my tripod are broken and some other reason, it's become quite hard for me. However, it's a fun. It's a fun when we make this video and then we cooperate with our friend to complete the assignment, to complete uh, cooking together. Even though now we just use the online, we can still talk to each other virtually, giving the idea, share the, share how the cook, share how the murtabak Maggi have become. As I say, my tripod is broken, so. I asked my sister to help me record the video. Fortunately, she is free today, so she helped me. Then, I can complete this task. That's all from me. Thank you. Hello everyone, come back with me in the reflection. Uh, for me, when I do this task, actually I can learn English very, more, very well and I can le learn English more. Uh, actually, English is a good language for me. Even I take, I am from uh, Bahasa Melayu course in Muxi. But for me, English is good to learn because uh, we can use it when we win, when we won. And then, 
uh, from this task, I can uh, learn new words. For example, uh, what muttering, mouth muttering, mouth, mouth muttering is it? Uh, before it, uh, I I don't know what is mouth watering but now I know it and then thanks for all my member in this group uh, because uh, help me uh, finish my task and then uh, I can I can know I can know how to work in the one team uh, we work together help each other and then we will we can finish this task uh, lastly, of course, that I have a new receipt to do a murtabak Maggi, and then we do it like yummy murtabak Maggi. So that's all from me. Thank you very much. Third semester now, but um. <coughs> <coughs> Cooking make me normally when we work up, we always want to eat. Am I right? <laughs> first thing first to prepare a pot. Cannot. Goodbye. <laughs>